Hey what's up guys, this is Curti Fox, and today we're going to be building the Nickel Plate Road 765. This is an S2 class, it's a 284 Berkshire type steam locomotive, and it was built for the New York, Chicago, and St. Louis Railroad, which is Nickel Plate Road, in 1944 by the Lima Locomotive Works. And it is very, very similar to the Pierre Marquette 1225, which is also a Berkshire type made by the Lima Locomotive Works. So they are very similar in appearance. And for the Nickel Plate Road 765, this operates today in excursion services and it is owned by the Fort Wayne Railroad Historical Society in uh, New Haven, Indiana. And this is actually commissioned by Rock Trout 331490. So thanks to him for making this video possible. And he also is going to commission the CNO 2716, which is on the way. It's another Berkshire type. Um, but yeah, for this video, we're going to be converting uh, the Pierre Marquette 1225 tutorial since it is very, very similar. Um, just you got to change some blocks here and there, and I will walk you through it. So go check out the Pierre Marquette 1225 tutorial and come back when you're finished. All right, so once we have the Pierre Marquette, let's convert it. So first off, we're going to delete these three blocks. Stairs, replace them with polished black stone brick walls. Iron trap doors on the sides of this. All right, and then we'll um, delete this bell over here. And we'll put a barrier instead. And um, <laughs> I don't know if you can get that in survival, so... Maybe you could just put a dark oak trap door, an upper one there instead if you can't do that. And we're going to place a bell on top. We're also going to add in um, wither skeleton skulls in front. Well, on the sides of that bell, just diagonally like this. And they'll be floating. And if you can't use barriers, again, just use a temporary block to place it down. Now, we're going to replace um, this uh, smoke box. So it's going to be saying to Rakas, so let's do that. So we're going to replace that middle area with Cyan terracotta, and also the corners are going to be polished deep slate steers, so let's do that as well. And uh, we're going to make this Cyan section and deep slate section, so it's going to be five blocks long. So I'm going to add in another four like that. Then we'll add in polished deep slate slab here, and another one right after the skull like that. Then we're gonna move uh, this slab over here, one block back, as well as this wither skeleton skull. And then we're gonna uh, move this slab here, one block back, delete this skull here, add in a dark oak trapdoor here, and a wither skeleton skull over here. Then we'll delete the trapdoors over here, and delete the black concrete underneath it, replace it with stairs, just like that. And then we'll go um, right to the back here, and we're going to replace this coal section. It's going to be different, so I move the coal pile all the way to the back. So let's start from scratch. We're going to take out coal, blackstone stairs, slab, blackstone pressure plate. So let's add in blackstone stairs facing the back, a coal block. And then blackstone slabs, two blocks here, and then one here, and then two on this side. And then we'll add in blackstone pressure plates, wrap that all the way around it, just like that. All right, and then we'll delete this ender dragon head and move this fence gate one block to the left. And then we'll add in two blocks wide of polished blackstone slabs like this. All right, and then the back, we'll delete this lamp here, delete the redstone torch. And then we'll move this black glass pane just one block to the left, so I'm going to do that. And then we'll add in a chain that's going to go horizontally like that. Add in a dark oak fence gate to the right hand side. Open that up. And inside we'll add in a glow item frame with a white glass pane in the middle of this. Alright. Next up, let's um, revise this uh, logo here. So let's go line it up to where we have the stairs here. Delete the block here. Add in an oak slab. And then we'll delete the oak slabs in front of it. Like that. And we're going to make it two. And it's going to be one and then one. So two, one, one like that. And the other side will do the same thing. So we'll try to... We're going to delete these two slabs here. And we're going to do it. So it's going to be uh, two, 
one and then one and then fill in the rest with black concrete and then we'll add in uh, black some buttons just like fill that in so that they go line up all the way down like that the other side we're gonna do the same thing just make it go all the way down just like that and the front of the tender we're gonna add another black some button here and a black some button inside like that other side same thing blocks the button here and then another one to the side we'll also add in these three blocks tall of dark oak fence gates and we'll open them all up for some handrails the other side we'll do the same thing adding in these handrails and open them all up just like that all right so next up let's go down over here and uh, we're gonna move this black concrete one block inside fill this in with a slab and the other side will leave this stairs alone, but the rest of it has to just turn into slabs. So it looks like that. And then we're going to have to change the driving wheels. So there's actually like a white trim to this wheel. So to do that, we're going to replace, you know, the corners of it. So to replace these corners with polish diorite slabs instead. And then polish diorite stairs in the bottom corners. So maybe a bit tricky to uh, add it but we'll have to do that and you're gonna have to do this to all of the wheels all the driving wheels so I'm just gonna stack it right now so that we have it on the side and for the other side we'll pretty much do the same thing just adding in that trim and I think the CNO they have the same trim as well adding white to the wheels like that very cool so far all right, and then we're gonna move this chain so it goes horizontally. So let's change that. And uh, let's go down here and delete this fence gate here. Add in polished blackstone brick slab like that. And move this fence one block inside like that. And we'll add a dark oak fence gate, open that up towards the front. Uh, another brick fence right on the outside like that. And then we'll close up this fence gate here all right and then we'll go on to the other side and uh, we'll delete this fence here add in a uh, polished blackstone brick stairs facing towards the front like that now for the inside of this cab we'll have to put back black carpet on top and then we'll go outside and we'll delete this oak button towards the back on both sides of the cab then on this side we'll add in a polished blackstone brick wall Place this trap door here on the side, that black carpet on top. Alright, and then we'll add in a chain in between these wither skull skulls. So it's uh, facing vertically like that. And I believe that should be pretty much it on how to make the conversion into the Nickel Plate Road NKP765 in Minecraft. And thanks a lot to Rockshrout331490 for commissioning this build and making this video possible guys are interested in commissioning trains of your own uh, check out the link in the description but anyways if you guys enjoy the video hit the like button down below subscribe if you had already i'll see you guys in the next one bye